Hey, welcome to a Sniper Side Bullet Point video, the Corona Containment Edition. Uh, everybody's sitting at home, so I wanted to put out some videos. And the first one we're going to look at is trigger control and follow through. In the beginning part of the video, I am shooting a Gap 6 GT with a very light trigger. I measured it. It's a single stage 13 ounce trigger. But you can see that I'm executing proper trigger control and follow through. Even though it's light, I could still marry up to it, and then I could fire and follow through without tapping the trigger, which is what a lot of people do. After that, I recently did a Sniper's Hide online training lessons with a Sniper's Hide member who is local to me, Jeff, and we went through our fundamental eval checklist with him and put that into a lesson. Well, he did a lot of things we see across the country with new students when we're doing fundamental evals multiple trigger presses, canting the rifle and having to straighten it back out. So Jeff's a great example for you to look at his execution because I will say this, his 100 yard group was sub half MOA. Okay, he shot a really good group at 100 yards. But take a look at his trigger control. Our rifle systems allow us to get away with a lot. However, you still want to execute the fundamentals to the best of your ability. That means marrying up to that trigger, Press, break, and freeze, following through when you see the results of your shots, come off the rifle, run the bolt, and send a follow-up if necessary. So take a look at this lesson. I want you to uh, go and make the comments. Everybody's sitting at home right now, and I think it's something good to compare your trigger control with what you see in the video. Does it look more like mine, or does it look more like Jeff's? We all have smartphones with cameras, can shoot video, so the next time you're out in the range, Film yourself in your trigger control and see what it looks like. People will often dry fire one way and live fire a different way. We want it to be consistent. We want to press, break, and freeze. We see the result of our shot. Reach up, run the bolt. Next case. All right, thanks for watching and enjoy. All right, five shots. You've got all kinds of stuff to work on, Jeff, so. Ah, uh, did you see that flinch? Uh -huh. 